Mills Canyon is a remote and off-the-grid location. Potable water is not available and cell service or Wi-Fi do not exist once you descend into the canyon. What does exist is a truly amazing variety of wildlife in such a small accessible area of northeastern New Mexico. As you go west towards the canyon across the expansive plains grassland, be aware that you may encounter North America's fastest land mammal, the pronghorn. Often mistakenly called antelope, the pronghorn can run long distances at speeds of 45 miles per hour. No, don't come towards us. <laughs> Go on. During the summer months, the western kingbird can easily be found perched on barbed wire fences along the road leading to Mills Canyon. Unlike the similar looking Cassin's kingbird, which favors more wooded areas, this kingbird prefers open country and can often be found along roadsides perched on fence posts, power lines, and small trees. Other birds that may be encountered along the nine mile drive from the highway include mountain bluebird and hornlark. During our visit, both the Rim Campground and the Canyon Campground were free to camp with a 14 day stay limit. We encountered this posted notice that fees may begin in 2022 for a fee of $12 per night for the Rim Campground and $10 per night for the Canyon Campground. The hefty male, black-headed grosbeak, is easily recognizable by its black head, large bill, orange underparts, and black and white wings. It is a common summer resident across much of western North America and spends the winter in Mexico. The green-tailed toey is typically a skulking bird that scratches at leaf litter concealed by dense understory in search of insects. It can usually be located by its distinctive mewing call. We were fortunate enough to find this confining bird out in the open at Mills Rim Campground. The tiny and plain looking house wren is a summer resident at Mills Canyon. It can be found all the way from southern Canada to South America. As seen here, it bounces side to side while singing its rich bubbly song with its short tail held high up in the air. Beyond the Rim Campground, RV and vehicles with trailers are not recommended beyond this point.
We photographed the following locally rare species in the pine forest area just below the rim. Zone-tailed hawk, red crossbill, golden crown kinglet, hepatic tanager, canyon tree frog, and the claret cup cactus. The Canadian River meanders from north to south through Mills Canyon. This lush riparian habitat attracts a completely different variety of wildlife that can be found on or near the rim. Beware that the summer temperatures can be very hot in the canyon and that the best viewing times are early morning and late afternoon. This is our campsite for the night here at Mills Canyon. It's a pretty nice campsite. Silver can't decide whether she wants to be in the shade or on her blanket. Typically found in open, semi-desert scrubland, grasslands, and rocky hillsides, the prairie lizard is a common resident of Mills Canyon and eastern plains of New Mexico. Adults can range from 4 to 7 inches or 10 to 18 centimeters in length, with the tail measuring about one and a half times the length of his body. Although the painted crescent may be somewhat identified by its dark upper wings with pale spots, the best clue to identifying this butterfly is the mostly unmarked pale yellowish cream hind wing below. Its range is limited to the southwestern United States and extreme northern Mexico. It can be found in Mills Canyon from April through October. The prairie rattlesnake is a venomous snake that can be encountered in a variety of habitats, including desert scrub, plain grassland, and pinyon juniper woodland. It is the most widespread and perhaps the commonest venomous snake in New Mexico. With the wingspan of three and a half to five inches, the two-tailed swallowtail is the largest butterfly in North America. Named for the twin tails of varying length on each hind wing, this species favors streamside habitats and other lowland areas across much of the western United States and Mexico.
formerly known as the Western Scrub Jay, the Woodhouse Scrub Jay is a common year-round resident of oak and pinyon juniper woodlands. Its range is mainly restricted to Nevada, the southwestern United States, and Mexico. The ash-throated flycatcher is a summer resident that can be found from late March through August. This pale flycatcher inhabits arid open habitats. It can survive in arid areas without drinking water solely by sustaining itself on the insects it eats. The southwestern orange tip is an early season butterfly that can be found from late February through April in areas of Pinion Jupiter woodlands and desert hills. Its range is restricted to the southwestern United States. The northern mockingbird can mimic a continuous string of 10 to 15 bird species as it perches prominently on top of a bush or post. It can be found singing throughout the day and even throughout the night on moonlit nights during its breeding season. A familiar bird across much of North America, the Canada goose has been introduced to many parts of the world, including areas of Europe, South America, New Zealand, and Japan. It seems to us that these geese were just having fun and listening to their honks echoing off the steep canyon walls. Other species that we have photographed in the canyon include summer tanager, midland smooth soft shelled turtles, white throated swift, and Narisa skipper. If you would like more information about Mills Canyon and other incredible birding areas, please consider purchasing the brand new Common Birds of Northeastern New Mexico. This 116-page field and site guide includes more than 150 species and up-to-date information on the 10 best birding sites. Cost is $17.95 plus shipping. Available now at fieldandsiteguides.com.